Okay, Salim. We know that Decibel has the Panther somewhere in that tower. Trying to go through the palace itself would be impossible. Luckily, this carpet shop is going to save us the trouble. Ah, yes. Honest Hassan's carpets. He owns many, many shops, but he is not so honest. Trust me. In fact, we used to run a flying carpet scam where he would pretend to be... Kind of pressed for time here. Fine. Please continue. So, according to my diagrams, the shop is connected to the tower. There's a vent system on the side of the building. All you have to do is crawl through the vents, and it will lead you straight into the shop. From there, you can make your way through the shop's interior to the tower. Hm. You make it sound so easy. I would like to see you crawl through vents when you are my age. Talk to you inside the shop. Good luck. Wait, this room doesn't match my blueprints. It must have been renovated recently. Give me a minute to figure this out. Oh, by Aladdin's beard. Do you not know that rule number 37 in the Thieves' Handbook is expect the unexpected, foresee the unforeseen, predict the unpredictable? Keep your turban on. My sonar readings show an old passageway through a cave system beneath the floor. Let's see. Massive payload, angle of incident, relative humidity divided by two. Got it. Salim. If we could drop that pallet of carpets in the corner, it should slash a hole in the floor straight through to the caverns below. We? It seems that I will be doing all the work. How about we just talk when you reach the passageway? If only I had a magic lamp, I would wish for this job to be over! Alright, believe you're in! Now you just have to make your way to the top of the tower! Of course, climbing, my favorite. I don't see an access point, but that lever looks worth investigating. And be careful not to stir up the scorpion nests in here. <laughs> Your friend is in a kind of hypnotic trance. The strange sonic frequency modulations emitted by that device are causing it. I've seen this type of thing once before on a mission in Prague. But this is on a whole new level. Mind controlled by music. It's genius. Uh, well, evil genius. Then all hope is lost. No, we just need to disable the device before freeing him. But we have to proceed carefully, or we risk turning his brain into jelly. What is this jelly? Oh, uh, sort of like baba ganoush or hummus, but M fruity. Ooh. Exactly. Just give me a closer look at that thing so I can turn it off. My brother, are you all right? Oh, oh, my head. Where am I? You have been imprisoned, hypnotized, and compelled to create forgeries by that evil elephant. But I have freed you from her mesmerizing music. With, you know, some assistance. That's nice. I'm hungry. Did you bring me anything to eat? Perhaps some nice roasted scorpion tails? Maybe some camel milk? Amazing! I climb halfway to the stars to rescue you, and you expect camel milk? Why do I bother? Sly, this is going to get dicey. Security has definitely been beefed up. Those turrets are too well protected to attack directly. Ordinarily, I'd hack the security system, but that might take some time, and we need to hurry. There's no telling when Decibel might move the lion again. This may be our only chance. So, what are you thinking, Bentley? I think we need to use some smoking mirrors. Uh, minus the mirrors. Meaning? I'll use the RC chopper to drop smoke bombs at strategic points, which should keep the turrets from seeing you. Then, since Salim knows this city like the back of his hand, he can guide you to a secure location. Hopefully he's had his nap today. <sighs> Just make sure you get to a safe spot before the smoke clears, otherwise you're gonna be missile bait.
job, Bentley. Okay, Sly, it's all you. Okay, Celine, we're on. Follow me closely, and don't fall behind. Don't worry about me. I'll be right on your tail. All right, it's go time, Sly. Age before beauty. No, 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 you mean wisdom before you. Would you two get going? Just waiting on the wise guy, Bentley. Open sesame! That outfit makes you a better thief, Sly, not a genie. Now why don't you help me with this door? <laughs> Close sesame! Eh, so you got lucky. Whew! The stench in here is making my eyes water. I feel sorry for your friend. That decibel is really cruel. Well, unfortunately, that might be the lion's socks. He always hated doing laundry. Oh, well, maybe she was just protecting her sense of smell. Oh, I had a terrible nightmare. I was being charmed like a snake and could not break free. That was no nightmare, my friend. Salim, you are in my dream, too. You brought me many delicious snacks. What is with you guys and all the food? Salim, who is this insolent pup? Oh, don't worry about him. He is a friend who helped rescue you. In fact, he is my assistant. Assistant? What are you talking about? Why? Play along. It's better if less people know what's going on anyway. Great. It's going to be a long day. Oh, and don't forget what's left of that device, Sly. I'm almost done with a little invention of my own. Okay, Murray, the thief known as the Tiger is being held inside that taxi shop. My data shows the interior is small, but well reinforced. Also, there don't appear to be any guards inside at the moment. I think this one is pretty straightforward. You and Sly go in through the front door. After that, your muscles should be enough to handle the situation. No problem, Bentley. My mighty biceps are itching to go to work. Wow, he's right there. This is going to be easier than taking pizza from a baby. I think you mean candy, buddy. Oh, yeah, I love candy. I think we need to be careful here, Murray. Something feels off. I'm over here, Murray. Hey, Sly, where are we? I'm not sure, pal. But it looks like we found the secret entrance to something. Sly! Murray, come in! Are you there? Bentley? I think you're breaking up. Sly, I don't think I can get over this wall. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. And we seem to have lost the Pinocchicom link with Bentley. Don't worry. Let's just keep moving forward. Hmm. There's bound to be a way out around here somewhere. Hey, Sly! I see some kind of weird switch up here. I'm gonna give it a try. Go for it, pal. I'm kind of stuck right now anyway. <laughs> <laughs> 